Well, welcome back to the channel. Uh, our son will be 15 in August and he still hasn't learnt that he should never say, Dad, I bet you won't do that. It's a quick glimpse of what we did a couple of weeks ago in North Wales uh, before the shoot. We were outdoors, but we weren't shooting this time. Thoroughly recommend a visit to Zip World in North Wales if uh, excitement's your thing. They do it above ground and underground in the caves. Absolutely brilliant time. So that's enough of that. Let's uh, get over and get on with the undisturbed squirrel shooting. So welcome back to the airfield again where I'm going to be doing hopefully the planned squirrel shoot I was going to do on Wednesday uh, before I got a phone call to go and try and help the sheep farmer. Uh, I say I've seen three squirrels on this feeder here with the trail camera that's been here. The box is full of nuts. Um, they've been active here until gone dark so I've got my infrared light source that comes with the sight mark race so hopefully if it does get um, beyond a certain light level I can switch it on and still see them all right with the black and white and then I'll probably have a, a quick drive around see if there's any rabbits we can pick off as well so be the same as last time hopefully with a little bit more action this time than um, just sitting in and talking to you so we'll see you later on. Well this feed has been on this tree for a good two months and the squirrels have had to put up with construction traffic and all sorts. A tail waggling, not happy about something. It's probably my car being here. Has he got a lump on his head? Oh, he has now. Ooh. Got a reason not to be happy now. This chap came along about half an hour later. They were a little bit slow. These are the sunflower seeds that he's eating. Not very good for you. This fellow had been down bullying uh, birds on the box, so he had to go. That's him down a tree. First visitor. This was a Sunday morning. And the model aeroplane club were flying today as well, so you'll hear them shortly. So that last clip was 8.42, so it's a good hour or so um, when this boat turned up. Thump on the ground, right next to his mate. Well, that one came through the trees. I didn't see that one on the floor, so came from the left-hand side. The others I've seen have all gone off to the right. So my calculations of what I believe were left were completely wrong. So you can never guarantee. If you see three, you're probably seeing nine. But the ones that went off to the right are busy making little squirrels I think by the noises I can hear so just page just sit here by the time and watch a will go by checking out his mates on the floor 
This one's come from the ground over to the right, so this is one of the group that went over on their rutting session. Biggles are still loop the looping over the top of us. He's running out of petrol. Ooh, double back somersault with a twist. And they're always side by side now, that's amazing. Right between the shoulder blades, I got that one. He got about 12 feet away uh, and I found him in the bush. That must have hurt. Only the one rabbit I saw going home, so uh, that's him down. That was that. Well, thank you very much. It was a short video, but it took days and days to make that. Um, thank you very much for joining me. Uh, look forward to seeing you on the next video. Uh, in the meantime, take care of yourselves. Cheerio!